A tomato plant growing in the city is certainly not extraordinary, except when you find it sprouting in a sidewalk crack on 10th Street in North Philadelphia. How did this hardy specimen get there? There is not an urban garden to be found for blocks. Did the winds carry a seed to this strange destination from someplace far away? Was the seed deposited? through the waste of a tomato-loving dog? What made this plant survive, it seems, without any necessity but sunlight? It's difficult enough to cultivate nice tomatoes on purpose. Oh, the sweet mysteries of nature. Memorial Day, 1935. The crowds leave the subway in Reading Railroad stations at Broad and Lehigh in North Philadelphia and line up at Baker Bowl, 15th and Huntington, for a Phillies doubleheader. The fans are unaware that in the first outing they'll be witness to baseball history. Cut loose by the New York Yankees at the end of the 1934 season, the struggling Boston Braves pick up 40-year-old Babe Ruth to hopefully rest them from financial ruin. In the top of the first, the Babe grounded out weekly to Phil's first baseman, Dolph Camilli. Just days before, Ruth hit his final three homers in one game at Pittsburgh's Forbes Field, one of them a 500-footer clearing the right field roof. In the bottom of the first, Phil's second baseman, Lou Chioza, hit a weak fly ball to left. The Babe stumbled and failed to field it. Chioza circled the bases, but was called out at home out of respect for Ruth. Hurt by his miscue, the Babe walked to the bowl's center field clubhouse, never to play again. In 1936, the Babe was elected to baseball's Hall of Fame. The Phils finished 1935 with a 64-89 record, 35 and a half games out of first place. Only the Boston Braves were worse. Baker Bowl fans commented about their ballpark advertising. The Phillies used Life Boy, but they still stink. One week before participating in Babe Ruth's last game, the Phils Lou Chiosa was the first to bat in the Major League's inaugural night game at Cincinnati's Crosley Field, May 24, 1935. In 1938, the Phillies moved seven blocks west to Shide Park from decrepit Baker Bowl. The Bowl's center field clubhouse was converted to the Alpine Musical Bowl. In the 1940s, Baker Bowl hosted both ice skating, it must have been warm that day, and midget auto racing. Baker Bowl, 15th in Huntington, was demolished in 1950. A school district of Philadelphia building now occupies the site where Babe Ruth played his final game.